Gather round people, I'll tell you a story, an eight-year-long story of power and pride. British Lord Betsy and Vincent Lingari were opposite men on opposite sides. Betsy was fat with money and muscle, like to stay here. Beef was his business, broad was his door. Vincent was lean and he spoke very little. He had no bank balance, hard dirt was his floor. From little things, big things grow. 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 Gringy were working for nothing but rations, where once when they had gathered the wealth of the land. Daily the pressure got tighter and tighter. Gringy decided they must take a stand. They picked up their swags and started off walking. At Waddy Creek they sat themselves down. Now it don't sound like much, but it sure got tongues talking. Back at the homestead and then in the town. From little things, big things grow. 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 Betsy man said, I'll double your wages. Seven quid a week you'll have in your hand. Vincent said, uh-uh, we're not talking about wages. We're sitting right here till we get our land. <laughs> Betsy ran more than Betsy man thundered. You don't stand a chance of cinder and snow. Vincent said, if we fall, others are rising. From little things, big things grow. From the things, big things go. From the things, big things go. From the things, big things go. Then Vincent Langari boarded an airplane, landed in Sydney, big city of lights. And daily he went round softly, speaking his story to all kinds of men from all walks of life. And Vincent sat down with big politicians. This affair, they told him, is a matter of state. Let us sort it out. Your people are hungry. And Vincent said, no thanks. We know how to wait. From the things, big things grow. 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 Then Vincent Lingari returned in an airplane back to his country once more to sit down. And he told his people that the stars keep on turning. We have friends in the south, in the cities and towns. Eight years long went by, eight y'all long years of waiting till one day a tall stranger appeared in the land. And he came with the lawyers and he came with great ceremony and threw Vincent's fingers toward a handful of sand. From the from the things, big things grow. From the things, big things grow. That was the story of Vincent Lingari. But this is a story of something much more. How power and privilege cannot move a people who know where they stand and stand in the law. From little things, big things grow. From little things, big things grow. From little things, big things grow. From little things, big things grow.
I'm a proud Gungaree woman. I'm here. My son puts me up to get on this microphone and he's saying, Mum, they won't let us in, Mum. Hang on. You realise what you're doing to our future generation, you fellas? You're killing them. You're killing them. This is a proud young Murray little fella standing here and he wants to get in there to be with these people. <laughs> My name's Darby. I'm coming to be with you. Yeah. He's saying, Mum, I want to come over there and dance with them too, Mum. You know, let us in to be with our people. You know, if you fellas done your homework, go home tonight and do your homework and see where your where your ancestors come from, because it's certainly not Australia. Yeah. Australia belongs to the Aboriginal people, us people. So go home, see where your ancestors come from, and then do your homework, because you aren't Australian. You come from somewhere else. Anyway, my brothers keep, and sisters keep dancing in there and fighting the fight, because we'll be out here to support you all the way. Oh